In this video, I'll explain how to troubleshoot keyboard problems in Windows 8 and Windows 7. You might want to try these suggestions if nothing happens when you press particular keys, if a key makes multiple characters appear, or if you have other keyboard problems. First, you should reinstall the driver. To do this, you'll need to open Device Manager. In Windows 8, hold the Windows key and press the X key to open a menu in the lower left, then select Device Manager. In Windows 7, type Device Manager in the Start Menu search field and press Enter. In Device Manager, expand Keyboard. Right-click the keyboard entry nested in the Keyboard category and select Uninstall. Now restart the computer and test the keyboard again. If it's still having problems, try cleaning the keyboard. Turn off the laptop and unplug all cables and connections. Leave the laptop in the open position physically so the keyboard is still visible. Turn it upside down and very gently move the computer back and forth to dislodge anything that might be stuck under the keys. If you see anything sticking out, you could remove it. Note that if you attempt to remove the keys, it's possible you could damage the keyboard. If that doesn't fix the problem either, you could try resetting the computer to factory defaults, called a reset in Windows 8, or system recovery in Windows 7. Please see our other videos on this subject for instructions in performing the factory reset. If that doesn't solve the problem, it likely requires servicing. I hope this video helped you troubleshoot your keyboard. For more information, visit support.toshiba.com.